Have you heard of the second brain in your gut? Here's a look at what the enteric nervous system, ENS, is. The second brain is believed to contain some 100 million neurons more than in either the spinal cord or the peripheral nervous system, sheaths of which are embedded in the walls of the long tube of our gut, or elementary canal running from the esophagus to the rectum. Equipped with its own reflexes and senses, the second brain handles digestion including the contraction and relaxation of intestinal muscles as well as the absorption of food. It is also capable of inflicting the occasional nervous pang. Ever felt butterflies in your stomach? The ENS contains 90% more serotonin and 50% more dopamine compared to the brain and its peripheral nervous system. The second brain can operate autonomously without being directed by the central nervous system, but it is not the seat of any conscious thoughts or decision making. While mental disorders like anxiety and depression are known to cause issues with digestion and the gastrointestinal system, recent studies have found that the connection between the gut and the brain may also trigger big emotional shifts in people enduring irritable bowel syndrome and functional bowel problems such as constipation, diarrhea, bloating, pain, and stomach ache. So the little brain in our innards in connection with the big one in our skulls partly determines our mental state and plays key roles in certain diseases throughout the body such as the neurodegenerative Parkinson's disease. And compared to men, women reportedly have a higher risk of vulnerability to illnesses arising from ENS disorders.